In good health, today we get kind of a sneak peek at a new emergency center at Beaumont Hospital in Royal Oak. A $120.8 million expansion and renovations, and it means big changes for patients and staff. Dr. McGeorge is here to show us what's all new, and it's pretty exciting for those folks. No doubt about it, Steve. You know, no one wants to end up in the emergency room, but if you do, there are certain things that can make the experience easier and improve your care. Now, Beaumont actually gathered feedback from patients, families, and staff, and they looked at emergency centers across the country to create a center that better meets all those needs. The biggest change for patients is significantly larger rooms with walls separating patients instead of curtains. We'll eventually have 135 beds of which 116 will be private. We'll have the four trauma bays, a 16 bed dedicated pediatric emergency center. There's plenty of state of the art equipment, but also little details that'll have a huge impact. One of the biggest patient requests, a place to charge a cell phone. And the remote doesn't just control the TV. I'm a patient, I'm in pain, I click that. There's a green light that goes on outside that room and the nursing staff knows that they need some attention for pain medication. One of the staff requests, keeping supplies close at hand. Our nurses and physicians design this new emergency center such that those supplies, that equipment, everything for the most part that they need is physically located inside of the patient's room. More tests will also be available at the bedside. For seniors, there's easy to read signs, elevated toilets, and grab bars. And families won't have to leave to grab a bite to eat. We actually created a cafe within the emergency center where there is easy access that will be available to patients and families 24 7. Even the helipad got a makeover moving from street level to the roof for easier access to the emergency center. Now, the new emergency center opens to patients on August 31st, and the complete four-phase project will be finished by the end of 2018. And to take a virtual tour, check out the health page at clickondetroit.com. These rooms will be a lot bigger. And oh, yeah. They're, yeah. they're much, much larger. They're going to probably be extremely comfortable for patients, families, mm -hmm. and allow better access for doctors and nurses. But with all the innovation, why do the gowns still open up in the back? <laughs> Beaumont, the gowns Work still open in the back. Come on, What can I tell you? <laughs> Get to work on that. All right. Don. Other hospitals have solved that. Oh, Just right. say that. We'll appreciate it. <laughs>